Hey everyone, this is a question from exercise 12.3, 9th question, chapter is duration proportion of class 6. The question is, a truck requires 108 liters of diesel for covering a distance of 594 kilometer. How much diesel will be required by the truck to cover a distance of 1650 kilometer? How to find out the answer? So before we do that, let's uh, let's write down what we know from the question. So it's given that the truck require 108 liters of diesel to cover 594 kilometer of distance, which means 108 liter. I'm just equating what I know from the question. 108 liter is equal to 594 kilometer. Now they're asking how much liter of diesel I want to cover a distance of 1650 kilometer. So I have to find out here in one kilometer how much liter I require like to cover one kilometer distance how much liter of diesel I require. So I have equated here from this we understand which number we should divide with what. So here you can see kilometer is given right I have to find out the kilometer. So you transpose this number to the other side so this will become 108 divided by 594 is equal to kilometer that is one kilometer we're talking about so when we divide this number whatever answer you got that much liter is required for covering one kilometer distance so once we know for one kilometer we can find out for 1650 it's just we have to multiply so i hope it's clear which number we're dividing with what so whenever you see this type of question equate them and then you will get the answer and if you want, if you like here, I'm finding out for one kilometer, how many liters of petrol is required. Suppose you have to find out that in one liter, how much distance is covering, then you have to find out liter, right? So you, you transpose this number to the other side. So this will become 594 divided by 108. So you will come to know that in one liter of petrol, how much distance is covered. Okay. I hope it's clear. Now let's find out. So you are using a unitary method here. We are finding for the 1 and find, once we f first we are going to find out for the 1 and then find out for the rest. So let's write on what we know from the question. So it's given diesel required diesel required for 594 kilometer distance is equal to 108 liter. So just now I explained you how to find out for the 1 kilometer. So therefore diesel required for 1 kilometer is equal to 108 divided by 594 kilometer 594 liter. Now you can divide this in two table because both are even number we can cancel in two table. So here how to cancel I am going to explain you. If you have your own method you can go with that and if it's if you find this thing easy go with this method. So we have a f 10 here right. So 2 5s are 10 and we have 4 so 2 4s are 8 like I am cancelling here itself. If you don't know this you can divide the number 5, 108 and write down the answer here 54. You have to divide 108 by 2 and whatever question you got that will be your answer. Same way I am going to cancel 594 in 2 table. So here 5 does not go right. So 2 2s are 4. 4 I am taking 2 2s are 4. 2 is my question. So you should write down only question here. 2 2s are 4. So 5 minus 4 1 is a remainder. So that 1 you write down along with 9. So that, that number will become 19. So 2 9s are is 18. 1 is a remainder. Write this along with 4. That makes a number 14. Then 2 7s are 14. So here we got 54 by 294. Now here you can see one number is odd and one is even so we cannot cancel this with 2. We want to cancel with this 3 table because both number goes in 3 table. So how to divide this? So 54 we have right. So 3 ones are 3 because 5 does not go. So 3 ones are 3. Then 2 will be the remainder. 5 minus 3 means 2 is a remainder. So write down 2 along with 4 that makes a number 24. So 2 so not uh, 2 3. 3 8 is 24. So we are getting 18 here. Okay. The next here also 297 cancel this in 3 table. So 29 does not go. So the less number is 27. So 3 9 is 27. So cancel this 3 9 is 27. 2 will be remainder. Write this along with 7 that makes a number 27. Again 3 9 is 27. We got 18 by 99 both goes in 9 table. So you should always cancel with a number which goes like we can divide both number with the same table. 
So we can cancel this in nine table. You can cancel this in even three table, but I'm doing directly so that I can reduce the number of steps. So nine twos are eighteen and nine elevens are ninety nine. So we got here two by eleven. So two by eleven liter of petrol is required for one kilometer. Like to cover one kilometer distance, we require two by eleven liter. So how to find out for one thousand six fifty? So for one you know, and you have to find out for the rest means you have to multiply here. That's it. Like suppose one chocolate cost five rupees. One chocolate cost five rupees. Then ten chocolate will cost ten into five. Yeah, ten five is a fifty 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 rupees, right? Same way. So let's find out this. So therefore, diesel required. Diesel required to cover. One thousand six fifty kilometer distance is equal to multiply them. So it is two by eleven multiplied by one thousand six fifty. Okay, it will be in liters. So cancel the number. You can cancel eleven and six one thousand six fifty in eleven table directly. Eleven ones are eleven, and here sixteen doesn't go right. So eleven ones are eleven. Five will be the remainder. Write this along with five. That makes the number fifty-five. And five fives are so eleven fives are is fifty-five. And then we have zero. So eleven zeros are zero. So we got one fifty, and we have a two in the numerator. So one fifty multiplied by two is three hundred. So three hundred liters of petrol is required to cover a distance of one thousand six fifty kilometer. So that's it. I hope this question is clear. In case you have any other question or doubts, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.